currently in the flutter we have a many patches that help to manage state apps and that's great but when we talk about state manage the scenario is a little different my name is Toshio Sada and you are on the fluttering hi today I will introduce you a package created and maintained by Brazil community called flutterando the triple triple has a goal to segregate the application state value in three parts objective value state error state and load state together in a single observable and we even have a name for this pattern we call it segment state pattern the idea is that you can use it with the main state manage pack that already exists like block value notifier mobax getx etc so for our example we will use mobax firstly we need to add some insertion packages for our application like dartz flutter triple and mobax triple Then we need to build a class that by convection we put the suffix store, which will be responsible for managing the state of our application. This class inherits mobx store and need two parameters, exception type and observable type. Those types could be primary type as int, char, string, double, but if you want to observe many value, we can create a new object. To avoid problem, it's important for our class to be immutable, right? We also need to create the constructor for our store and call the parent constructor passing a parameter the initial value of my observable now we can create the method that will change the value of our observable so that will be on the variable stage if you need to update you can use the function called update this way we can update the first segment of triple if you need to update other segment we can use set load to send a load state and set error to send a error state if we are using dirtz package and are working with eaters we can use the function called execute eaters At our screen to get your activity, we need to include the, our widget that will be updated in Triple Builder. It's working similar to the observer of Mobex. It will execute the builder function every time you update the value. But if you want to segment our state, you can use Scope Builder. Here you can you can render when your application is on the load state, or if you you throw a error state, and when the state value is ready, you can render other widgets. Cool, right? Now it's easier to work with state manage. So that's it. Please like, share this video and subscribe to the channel.